Hi, it's Susan here and welcome to In The Craft Room. It's been a while since we've released an episode and that's because there's been a delay in the distribution of our magazines. But today I'm so pleased to have issue number 71 of the Peter Rabbit Patchwork Quilt Partworks. With this magazine you'll receive a piece of the candy blue fabric for our vines around our central panel applique. You'll also receive a much needed piece of bondaweb. At the back of the magazine are the templates for our blue vines and this is what we're going to be appliquing on today. There's a lot to do so let's get cracking. I'm going to start by removing the template sheet at the back from our magazine. We've got the template pieces number one, number two from a previous edition and three and four from this issue, issue 71. We're going to trace both sides of these template sheets so there's a lot to do. I'm also glad we've also received additional pieces of the Bonder web from the previous magazines as well. We're going to need them. There's 15 vine pieces and I'm going to start tracing them now. But before I start tracing, I've realized that the Bonder web pieces aren't long enough to trace out some of the vine template pieces. Whoopsies. So I'm going to use my own bonder web that I had stashed away. This can be cut by the meter. I bought about four meters just in case and it's a good thing that I did. Time to get tracing. So I've traced out all of our 15 pieces. I'm going to be cutting these out very carefully next and placing them onto our blue fabric. So all of our vine pieces of bonder web have been cut out. I'm going to be keeping all of these off cuts of the bonder web for when we applique our rows on the corners. I'm going to be working out the most economical way so all of our bonder web pieces fit onto this tiny piece of candy blue fabric. It's now time to press our bonder web onto our fabric. All of our pieces are pressed onto the fabric and we're going to really carefully cut them out. When I've cut them out, I'm going to remove the back of the bonder web and place them where they are meant to go on our central panel applique. The vines are going to be swirling around the outside on our patchwork frame. Thank you. 
So all of our pieces have been cut out and placed in their final position. Now we're going to be pressing it on very carefully. And here we have finally our blue vines appliqued around our central panel applique. I'm really happy with it. It took a few hours to do, so make sure you set aside a whole morning or a whole afternoon for this project. Thank you for joining me today. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Please hit the subscribe button as well as the bell to be notified of future episodes. And I look forward to seeing you next time where we begin to add our roses amongst our blue vines. Until next time, bye.